So I'm at the salon where my stylist is gonna give me a makeover and I'm gonna do it before. It's all the different lightings here. And I'm completely fresh faced. And I will vlog a little during and show the after. Finish. We'll keep our makeup on all day long. So I shake it, pull back our bang, and the sprayer. We'll let that dry, and she'll be good. Thirty minutes later, and I'm already not able to see my eyebrows. So that's gone. My skin looks oily and shiny. I'm gonna stick with my Bare Essentials makeup. Look at this, it's good. They're like not even on my This is such a joke. Like seriously, these women wear these all day and they stay on? I even had them professionally put on and they're not staying on. Okay, I just applied my Bare Minerals powder. I'm gonna do my eyebrows. My Anastasia brow pencil. I know that that stays on all day. That powder did not. And I can reapply my makeup later that day, you know, if I need to. I mean, it's no big deal to just, you know, throw a little makeup on. Because that, having that, that makeup felt so caked on my face. It didn't even feel natural. And I really like the mineral powder better, I think. <laughs> okay, eyeliner. I ordered liquid eyeliner, but I think... I'm gonna cancel my order because I've always liked this pencil from Revlon and I don't think that I would be able to put a liquid on very well. So, all right, the problem is I can't see. So, this blue one. I bought these lashes, so, and I bought this glue. So we're gonna see. I don't remember which lash was left, was was left, and which one was right though. I just washed it all off and now my face is blotchy and red because my skin is so fair. I'm gonna have to wait like an hour before I start over again. But I'm learning. You're 50 years old, Kevin. You've been putting makeup on for 20 years. And although you're not a professional, you know what works for you. So 
why would it be any different on a special day? Mm. You know when they take pictures? They filter them anyway. <laughs> and I, if I'm only worried about having this makeup on for the photos, that's what photographers are for. That's what filters are for. But I looked like a caked up mannequin. So I'm gonna be fine. Once my face calms down from rubbing it so much, I'll just do my fresh makeup face that I always do when Chris and I go on a date and I will look beautiful and fine. Okay, my face is still a little bit blotchy and red from all the rubbing I did on it, but I just put a regular fresh face with mascara. And honestly, this is what I plan to do for the wedding, but just a little bit more and touching up throughout the day. My eyes are kind of red and puffy from rubbing them, so I won't have that issue as well. So now I have to edit all this footage I've taken today to see if I do have a video that's worth bringing encouragement to anyone. <laughs>